Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here? So what we have here, this solution we have a times a, which is the same thing as a squared. That's the same thing multiplying. I write this as 5 raised to power x or squared equals to 60 on this side. And this follows when we have a raised to power m raised to power n. This same thing as a raised to power m n. But this here, this power multiplies here 5 raised to power 2x equals to 60 here. That is, here we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 5 raised to power 2x equals to log 60 from here. Then here, we apply the power law of log n. Well, we have log n raised to power p. This same thing as p log m. But this here, we have 2x log 5 equals to log 60 from here. Then here, we divide both sides by log 5. Divide this side by log 5. Also, divide this side by log 5. That this here, log 5 cancelled each other. And we have 2x equals to log 60 over log 5. Then, next step here, we can express 60 as 5 times 12. That is what we have becomes 2x equals to log 5 times 12 over log 5. And this follows the law of log n. Now we have log a times b, which can be written as log a plus log b. At this a we have 2x equals to log 5 plus log 12 over log 5. Then, Next step here, we separate this into two fractions and we have 2x equals to log 5 over log 5 plus log 12 over log 5. That is here, log 5 cancel each other, we have 1 left. This becomes 2x equals to 1 plus log 12 over log 5. Then also from here we can write 12 as 4 times 3. That is what we have becomes 2x equals to 1 plus log 4 times 3 over log 5. That is this also follows the log logarithm. I can write as 2x equals to 1 plus log 3 log 4 plus log 3 over log 5. And also here we separate this into two fractions and we have 2x equals to 1 plus log 4 over log 5 plus log 3 over log 5. Then we can also write 4 as 2 times 2 and that's 2 square. Then here this becomes 2x equals to 1 plus log 2 squared over log 5 plus log 3 over log 5. That is here we apply the power of log n. 2 comes here, and this becomes 2x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 over log 5 plus log 3 over log 5. Then, 
Next step, we apply change of base. When we have log A over log B, we can rewrite this as log A to base B. As this, what we have becomes 2x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5. From here, we divide both side by 2. Divide this side by 2. Also, divide this side by 2. Now, this here, 2 cancelled each other. And this becomes x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5 all over 2. We have the value of x here. Then, let's check if this satisfies this given problem. And this we substitute the value of x to this problem, which is x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5 all over 2. And this what we have here becomes 5 raised to power 1 plus. 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5 all over 2 times also 5 raised to power 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5 all over 2 is it equals to 60 on this side at this here we have same thing, 10 base multiplying. Follows on we have a raised to power m times a raised to power also same power m. This can be written as a raised to power m plus m. That's 2m. At this, we can write this as 5 raised to power 2 times 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5. All over 2 is it equals to 60 on this side? As this here, this power multiplies two here cancel each other. We have 5 raised to power 1 plus 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5. Is this equals to 60 on this side? And this here. We apply a law of indices a raised to power m plus n. This same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power n. Then, yeah, this becomes 5 raised to power 1 times 5 raised to power 2 log 2 base 5 times 5 raised to power log 3 base 5. This is equal to 60 on this side. And 5 raised to power 1, that's 5. Then times we reverse this 2 up from power log. We have 5 raised to power log 2 squared, that's 4, is 5 times 5 raised to power log 3 is 5. Is it equals to 60 from here? That is this, this follows when we have a raised to power log b to base a, which is equals to b. Then yeah. We have 5 times 4, then times 3, is it equals to 60 on this side? And 5 times 4, 20, 20 times 3, 60, equals to 60 from here. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that x equals to 1 plus. 2 log 2 base 5 plus log 3 base 5 all over 2. Satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell. Share this video with thumbs up. See you next class and bye for now.